Um, anemia is a health condition where there are not enough red cells in your body to adequately supply all the oxygen needs in your body. Um, it can occur for a variety of reasons. Um, however, in pediatrics, the most common reason that we see is iron deficiency anemia. Uh, it's actually one of the most common referrals that we get in our practice. Iron is important because it helps to make a protein which exists in the red cells called hemoglobin and it's this protein which carries your oxygen around like a little shuttle and drops it off to the cells. So there are some red flags which uh, may be common that uh, would indicate that maybe you should take your child to see a physician. Um, one would be if your child is more tired than normal, if they're falling asleep in class, if they're unable to keep up with their peers with regular activities, that would be an indication that maybe there's something going on. Um, if they're beginning to complain of dizziness or headaches um, and just being very tired all the time, that unable to concentrate in school, that would be an indication. Iron deficiency anemia can occur due to a lack of adequate iron in your diet. Um, and so we tend to see it really in two key areas in pediatrics. One is in your preschool children as they transition from having, you know, breast milk or uh, iron fortified formula to having cow's milk a lot. Um, and you know, sometimes we see children having 24 to 36, 48 ounces of milk, of whole milk a day. And while milk has a lot of nutrients, one of the things that is missing is adequate iron. And so we see the kids maybe filling up on uh, cow's milk and not taking iron rich food. And that's an area where they are, end up being iron deficient. Another point uh, where we see it is in teenagehood. Uh, teenagers have a horrible diet, as we all know. Uh, they eat lots of processed foods, which do not contain significant amounts of iron. And especially in our teenage girls who may be having a heavy menstrual cycle, they may be losing a lot of blood there. And so they have a dual effect of poor intake and blood loss leading to iron deficiency. We encourage prevention um, primarily with uh, having an iron-rich diet throughout life. Um, which includes things such as red meat, of course, but even our patients who may be vegetarian, so many green leafy vegetables, spinach, kale has a fantastic amount of iron, so does watermelon, oatmeal, tofu, tofu burgers are great, um, <laughs> sunflower seeds, so there are a variety of ways that you can get it. It doesn't just have to be broccoli.